A drone for strategic use powered by solar power is soon to be a reality. Indian firm Garuda Aerospace is working on a solar power drone Suraj. Solar cells fitted on the drone's large wings are meant to power the UAV along with a backup battery. Vyon Siddharth MP spoke to Agneshwar Jaya Prakash, the founder of Garuda Aerospace. Listen in. Indian drone company Garuda Aerospace has unveiled a new solar-powered drone known as Suraj. To talk to us about it, we have the CEO of the firm, Agnishwar Jay Prakash. Agni, please tell us about uh, this new drone, Suraj. Uh, we at Garuda Aerospace are quite excited to have uh, Suraj being unveiled today by the ex-DRDO chairman, Dr. Satish Reddy, who is also the principal scientific advisor to the Rashtra Mantri. Uh, Suraj is a high altitude solar powered drone. It also has a, um, a battery operated uh, payload as well. We also uh, intend to utilize it for surveillance and reconnaissance operations, especially in border areas. Uh, it is a pride and joy because uh, ever since we launched Vajra and unveiled it at the Defense Expo uh, in 2022, there has been a significant traction for us uh, to ensure that we have a sustainable drone which will fly for longer duration. Vajra flies for about five to six hours and we wanted uh, the Suraj drone to fly anywhere between eight to twelve hours of time. So that was the motivation behind the Suraj drone. We are very happy that it got unveiled today at the Aero India show which was inaugurated by our Honourable Prime Minister and I believe that uh, the game of drones has just begun. We have a lot of amazing innovation and ingenuity that is spearheading India into becoming and transforming into the uh, drone global hub by 2030. We are just standing by the model of uh, Vajra, which is your stealth drone. Tell us more about this project, how far have you come and what more to do? So we've uh, done the basic design as well as the uh, uh, testing of it in terms of how it will behave in various different conditions and scenarios. The one is to one prototype is uh, behind us today. Uh, we've been uh, engaging with several uh, engine manufacturers because if you look at uh, Vajra, uh, it is a jet powered drone. Um, and I believe that the jet engine is going to be crucial for the payload uh, aspect as well as its endurance. And um, today we've had a lot of traction for Vajra in the Defence Forces. Hopefully it should be ready by the end of this year. Ultimately uh, a lot of uh, uh, funds are required and we are very happy to announce that today uh, Garuda Aerospace has raised uh, $22 million which is the largest ever Series A fundraise for the drone segment. So we are very positive that uh, Vajra as well as uh, Suraj will definitely see uh, flights uh, towards the end of this year. Okay, so Garuda's uh, Kisan drone was the first in the country to receive the certification from the DGCA. Tell us more about it. What does that mean for a drone to receive a DGCA certificate? Well, uh, we were actually the first ones to receive the uh, dual DGCA certification of both the uh, type certificate for manufacturing as well as uh, the uh, RPTO uh, certification which is meant for training of these rural entrepreneurs and service providers. This is an extremely unique aspect and one of the major reasons why we did raise such a large fundraising round. Uh, but most importantly, I feel that uh, uh, the DGCA type approval is very important because it ensures that uh, indigenous made in India drone startups uh, have preference and precedence over uh, imported uh, drones and also uh, the, there have been a lot of progressive policies that have been placed by the Indian government especially in terms of uh, loans for drones as well as 50 to 70 percent subsidies for these uh, Kisan drones and ever since the Honorable Prime Minister launched 100 of our drones in 100 different locations we have received several uh, traction of uh, like many countries wanting our Garuda Kisan drones and also you know that Mahindra Singh Dhoni is our brand ambassador as well as a shareholder and after he uh, revealed the drone drone we've also received significant traction for our videograph drone as well, which hopefully will be launched during the IPL time. Thank you, Agneshwar. So that was Agneshwar Jay Prakash telling us about the developments at Garuda Aerospace with video journalist Tarakram, Siddharth MP, Vion, World is One.